Greetings, my Baita friends. Ben Pearson, the Rosa Tracker, and I've just hijacked a train. Left my locomotive there. Sad day. Um, I did... Well, we had the long episode that some of you might not have done, have watched the entire thing. We went and explored around. We've been clearing up biters. These guys are mostly contained. We need to put a little bit of containment in there, but I think we have plenty of containment. Like, it's going to take a very long time before we start to tickle some of these biters, and these guys are most likely going to come through here. These guys, I'm not sure. This one, we still should deal with. But I'm going to deal with that later. Um, this episode, we're going to get ready to go uh, start packing and stuff like that. Let's come over this way. So part of the supplies that we bring with us everywhere is going to be helpful for going to another planet. But first thing I want to do, I want to do research station two. Okay. So it's still got a launch. What we're going to try to do is something that's a little bit better contained. 2.9 megawatts. Do I actually need these solar panels? I don't know that I do. All of these rockets should be ready to go. And we should have a starter pack here. Wait a sec, we don't have the starter packs. Why not? What are you doing? Um, psh, that's a stupid move. Okay. Well, we'll get this taken care of. While I'm at it, what was the planet that we unlocked? It was... Fulgura. We're also going to launch Fulgura 1. And those are that's the main two things that we're gonna do this time is to get these guys ready to go. So obviously it's gonna take a little while. Let's see if there's anything we can do to improve things here. I mean, the problem is, is we just don't have that many asteroids that tickle here. So that will help a little bit, I think. Okay. May not help that much though, unfortunately. We actually have quite a bit of carbon. The amount of iron that we have backed up... <gasps> Wait a sec, that was the limiting factor for space science. Oh, sweet. So I'm going to filter... the... Metallic asteroids. And let's go to the other direction. Okay. We'll eventually get them launched and that will allow us to get quite a bit more iron. 
And thus, more space science. Um, we have a decent amount here, though. Let's go ahead and en enlarge that some. Okay, research station two. We're going to try something radically different. So, I'm not sure what the best format is for these. So we're just gonna kind of wing it. Um, I've been trying to decide how to do this. Crushers, let's build a column of these here. Let's go like here. And then a column Oh, those are not the right spots. Okay, we're probably going to need some power at some point in time, too. So let's go ahead and set that up. I'm going to trust we don't need power poles up here. Yeah. No. Let's go more like here. So we're not going to have any power for a little while, which is not a surprise. Then we're going to need... Inserters. And then the outserters go here. put a splitter here. The splitter... Well, I'm gonna put this the asteroid type. So we'll assume we'll do metallic... Wait, this is not right. We do need splitters, but they need to go here. There also needs to be one here. Okay. She think I want to do this like this. So I'm going to put this belt Okay, and then we need miners here. Actually, instead of this, let's filter the positive. So that means we're going to filter the other direction. The reason being is we may use this belt for other purposes. Then this needs to go to smelting, which is going to be right here. Okay. 
I need one more space, okay. Eventually the solar panels will make their way up and maybe we'll even have enough. Um, okay, let's do asteroid collector here. I need it to be here. We'll do one maybe here. Just toss these on here. And I'm not gonna filter these by any particular type. So the goal is here. So this is gonna be metallic asteroids. You will be carbonic asteroids. I do not know how this is going to work, but we'll do carbon here. And you filter carbonic type asteroids. This doesn't need to be this complicated. Okay, so now we've got the carbon. Got everything that we need that's here. Um, Let's move these asteroid catchers. Okay. This is going to take a little while to build up, but this is fine. You need to be switched to ice. This needs to be switched to ice. And what happens if it gets all the way through, then we do need it to come back. This needs to be prioritized, actually. So input priority from there. 
So many shipments coming. It's okay. It's a little expensive to ship all this stuff up. Um... I wonder... We'll have iron. What if we... make... belt here? Let's go to research station here. So we have lots and lots of iron at this point in time. What if we... Oops, let's build... here? Here? You're gonna be gears. You're gonna be um, belts. Then I don't know how we're gonna get this. We could just take it on the same line as the science, I guess. We have these. Gotta make sure this is on the top, which it will be. So that belt should now make it into here. Very nice. So I wonder if this will allow us to ship stuff to others. Wait a sec. We can just do this, can't we? Nope. It's worth a shot. Increase the hub and landing pad inventory size. Oh, that gives us more spots here. Okay. So now the belt is coming. So can I do, let's see, logistics network, connect if wireless belt is less than 100. There we go. So we'll store up to 100 belt. And then hopefully we'll ship these, surely we'll ship these from one station to another. So that'll save us a little bit. Let's fill in the holes here. Okay, let's see. We do want to put these guys on the same belt. Hang on.
I want to actually have this belt go this way. Okay. Okay, so next is the assemblers. Let's go this way, maybe. Um, problem is, is this design is not fully extensible. Ooh, hoo -hoo. Okay, let's kill this. And you're going to be space science, please, if you please. Okay, <clears throat> now we need one more belt. This is where the minor catchers thing go. I do have a feeling this is going to get all jammed up eventually, but we're going to see how well this does. Cool. Oh, we do need thrusters. Thrusters, steel, processing, electric engines, yep. So that's just going to be another thing on this line. stack is probably enough <clears throat> you know I think it's time for more of these Rockets. In fact, let's go big or go home, right? Oh, 
And then I just need two, three. That should do. We should start launching some serious rockets soon. Okay. So Fulga 1 here. We need mostly ice asteroids. Then we need to convert these into rocket fuel. So there's a oxidizer and there's a um spoilage volume ore don't have any of that yet so we got the ice hang on working i don't know what that is Hmm. Well, let's add some thrusters down at the bottom here. Okay, we can see that it needs some liquids. Hopefully one thruster is enough. So let's just see. Mm. Ice melting is in a chem plant. And then the fuel is from carbon. Well, ice melting will be into water, which may not be helpful. Um, oh, here we go. Thruster fuel, carbon, and water. So we're going to need a lot of water. Iron ore and water. <gasps> no! Where? Oh. Here, huh? Did I? I thought I killed that base. No, oh, oh well. It's fine. So, anyways, maybe I'll do that at the end of the episode. We're getting close. Fulga one here. So, we need a lot of water. So, we're going to need some chem plants. Um, we actually need something fairly similar, I think, to this. In fact, I'm going to copy all of this. We're going to take, get rid of these. This will be carbon and water. The water, we need chem plants. So that'll get us the water that we need. Since we can't walk around. Okay. So we're gonna do like this. I 
I'm actually going to put a filter here because I don't want the water to escape. Not oxide ice. And then you're actually going to go this way. gonna go like this to do do I'm gonna move this thruster. We'll move it to. Can we rotate it? No, we can't rotate you. Really? Um. Okay. Well, fine. We'll leave you there. I'll put some solar panels. Let's do solar panels here. Oh, I didn't copy the bottom part of this. Because I didn't need to, okay. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before this guy is going. Um, so you're gonna make rocket fuel. Hang on. Can I just put the... Put this, like, right here? I have no idea how well this is going to work. Okay, let's do an underground. And we're going to actually have you be the oxidizer. Then we need a belt that goes all along here. Once again, I have no idea how well this is going to work, but we're going to find out. Um, I 
Ooh, we got a solar panel. Nice. So things are no longer blinky blink. Okay, hopefully we're getting stuff on here. Bingo. Oh, I didn't finish this part of it, did I? Okay, let's see this work. Wait. Should be iron. Oh, fudge. So let's go here and let's fix this real quick. I thought there was something that was off. Then, since the goal of this one is actually to send stuff, I'm going to put an extra cargo bay or two. I don't know how we're going to want this in the long run, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, this is moving quite nicely. We haven't got any ice yet. I have a feeling this is going to get jammed eventually. But we'll see how this goes. What a complicated, complicated system. But hopefully we can figure a better way to do this for the future. All right. We're doing better. I assume the problem is I just don't have the rocket silos yet. All right. Um... It actually kills me a little bit. Could have probably just put a roboport there or flushed out that station. Why did I kill this? That's got to be troops. Maybe it's the further? <gasps> it's even further out. Oh no. Still, I think we'll be fine. This is just a little bit of a canary in the coal mine. Not enough storage space available. Ew. All right. Um. Next time I'm here, that will be fixed. And I'm hoping that we have things established. Surely our belt must be produced locally now. Are we actually shipping this? How would we know? Hmm. 
Now, one thing I am going to do... You make it all the way down here. I'm going to make another battery. We're just going to put standard ammo. Which means this is going to be probably real bad. Oh, whoop. We're just tossing out ammo into space. Oh, jeez. Uh, that's actually kind of cool that you can do that, but... Hmm. It's not really what we want. What we want is a few gun turrets. I have no idea how well these are going to work. All right. Um, well, we're going to start launching some serious, serious rockets. Let's go ahead and request a tank. These should have one in the inventory somewhere. Might even do spider trons. I've never done spider trons. Okay. Let's go just get to the train. And we only have 20 of these. Jeez. We got to improve the rate. Well, then again, they're so good. Like five of those is better than 30 of the other ones. <clears throat> Three of those is better than 30 of the other ones. Okay. Let's go ahead and load you up. That was more coal, more faster than I had realized it would be. So let's go... Let's start with this. Just to fix that. And this train... I'm going to tell you to go... Here? And then back to pick up. It's actually going to take you quite a ways to turn around. You'll turn around there. It'll be fine. Okay, so we're going to go here. Okay, we got that. Good. Now... so far. Fine, let's go all the way up here. Okay. Now I'm going to remove this guy. We 
We don't have explosives yet. a little wacky but that'll do so now we can go all the way down here tile platform on okay so research station 2 has some holes We're gonna start getting some guns. I don't know if it's gonna do us any good, but it'll sure be fun to find out now, won't it? Maybe some of these ones will have a chance. What is your problem? Okay, that's fine. Okay, we should have our tank, which we do. Now let's go... Uh, I'm gonna set a RoboPort to protect the uh, laser turrets that we've got. A single RoboPort with a few robots should be plenty to keep it topped off. Okay, let's get our forward operating base set up. Not sure if that's the right term for it, but I'm gonna go with that. Seems like it is, because it's you're close to the the center. Two, three, four, let's go with five, I think. We got a behemoth. No! Okay. Keep going. That is a lot of acid. Better just run away for a little bit. Okay. Ooh, so many worms. Okay, dead. Let's go on to the next one. I'm gonna put two more. Sets of five.
those behemoths are so nasty. Oi, ay, ay. That's a bad spot to have died in, too. Well, um, this is gonna be fun. Hmm. Let's pick up what we can. Um, I'm gonna pick up large power poles. Half a stack. And then I'm gonna pick up... Two kilometers away. Wowzers. Only two destroyer castles, huh? Okay. And then let's get whatever laser turrets there are and then we'll have at it again. Uh, the locomotive is going to be a pain, but we'll deal with that one later. It's nice to have some serious rocket power though. Hopefully we got enough. 70 turrets is actually no joke. Do we have one that we can tell to return home? Not really. Um, let's go to oil pickup and we'll take it as far as the steel station. We should build a turnaround or something high up just to deal with this kind of problem. Then we could always leave a little train there, but yeah, this will do. I could request the tank, but nah. <gasps> the stone mine is almost done, guys. Look at this. Got caught up in the pipe. Okay. Let's go. Let's go to here. And just to make sure it doesn't cause any. Well, it'll go to pick up right after. So that's fine. Uh, it won't be able to leave until steel. But steel will leave eventually and it'll be fine. This is such a long ways to walk. I'm actually going to get out here. No, oh, I don't have robots. I was going to say I was going to get out there to let the robots do a little bit of work, but foolish me, I don't have robots with us. Okay, we still have a kilometer to walk. Wow. That's crazy. That is absolutely insane. Um, well, I don't know that I know any good jokes. So this is going to be another fairly long episode, but uh, it just ends with biter fighting. That's all. I just really hope the biters don't 
come across now. Be kind of bad to encounter them in this area. Okay. Must have left some gun turrets there a very, very long time ago. Just a little bit more to go. Stronger explosives, okay. Hopefully our science is getting researched a lot faster now. This is gonna be rough. This is gonna be really rough. Um, we can build some forward defenses at least. But we died close to the base. Well, we have that. Does it have any ammo by chance? Probably not. Nope. Still, we may as well take it. Forward operating base, go. I'm going to set up a second one of these. And then we're going to go tickle them, get them to come here, and hopefully that'll distract them. is dead. No! Again! Well, this is bad. Okay, um, what do we do differently? Huh. <laughs> well, for one, let's take the tank. I guess we can set up a lot more defenses too. That'll do, I guess, and then we'll dump everything we've got in there. We got a tank now. Then we need all of these destroyer capsules. Hopefully, we got more than two. Even if it's just three. Three. Woo! Laser turrets are not going to help us any. Okay. So now what do we do? Hmm.
let's see. We still have a decent amount. Uh, I see a train coming this way, so that's promising. But let's just go to oil again. We'll take that same train, and then at least now we have a tank. We blew up one of our tanks, though. Should have taken some bullets, too. Deck them. Can just go to here. Then I'm going to switch this so it'll go back to the pickup. Yeah. What a light inventory. This is going to be insane. Yeah, sorry for the slightly longer episode, but you know, the biter fighting, it's not for everybody, so I like to tack it on to the end. But it is necessary to keep a certain amount of it, for sure. Let's get a few of these trees. One more. This might be enough to take us the full kilometer. It'll definitely be enough to make some really good progress on it though. Okay, this is looking good, looking good. Yeah, we're killing a few trees here. That's fine though. So three stacks, we probably did kill at least a little bit while we were there too. Probably not as much as I would have liked though. sec. Okay. So this is the forward operating base. Okay. First of all, deploy. Now, let's kill most of these guys. Those behemoths are so freaking annoying. So we got one more. Let's go ahead and deploy it. No fish, of course. That's okay, we're just gonna stay here and heal up. And hopefully we can make it once we're fully healed to the other body. We got everything picked up. Good. Thank goodness. They're really good at...
Okay. So the shield is dying, but the shield is okay. It's meant to take some hits. Thank goodness, this is all going away. Ah. Hallelujah. Um. This is kind of a dead end, so let's deconstruct this. I will leave one turret here with a uh, radar. And we do need to take care of both of those bottom ones too. Well, we've got 11 towers, so that's pretty decent actually. Oh, this is a long episode, but that's okay. Okay. I'm sure the drones are gonna die soon. Which is perfectly acceptable. This one is one that I would like to take care of, I think, but it's not the most important one. These guys are pretty important. I think I ran out of power poles last time, which is why I didn't radar this area better. So let's go see what's down there. I think this is a two. Probably a three. Three seems about right. Let's see if we can get this last one. We'll add two more. That should be plenty. Now let's go off to the big one and I'll use all the rest of my drones and then I'll end the episode there but between episodes the plan is to um, set up a few radars in this area so we can extend our vision even further. Okay, shields up. Tank's slowing down. Is it out of fuel? It's basically out of fuel. Oh dear. Don't need a lot. Oh, we have plenty of fuel. Who am I kidding? We've been running over coal rocks and all kinds of stuff like that. We just didn't have it automatically loaded in. It's kind of nice to just kite, let the robots do their dirty work. These robots are so, so good. They're expensive, but man, are they good. 
Okay. So let's get out of the goop. And then what? I'm not gonna kill that. Um In the interest though of minimizing things, I'm going to set up a wall from here. I'm just gonna hop out. We have a decent number of these now. So we'll put the radar here. I said I was going to do this between episodes. So I'm going to finish this out between episodes. But thank you guys so much for joining me. Let me know whatever questions, comments you guys have. Appreciate all you do. Till next time, keep on tracking. Take care. We will see you then. Bye-bye.